In Domus 3D, it is possible to select configurable furnishings from the components window, opening the dedicated tab. Users will have the possibility to insert customizable 3D items into their project, which follow the specifications set by the chosen manufacturer, creating various compositions which can be modified in each individual part provided by the manufacturer. In the components window on the left, we can choose the collection that we want to use, and then scroll through the various types of pieces available. Let's select, for example, the bathroom sink base vanity category, height 50 cm and depth 50 cm. We'll find here a list of all the items available. Let's now select the item that we want to insert into the project, opening the dedicated modular furnishing window. Let's position our vanity base on this wall and return to the components window to search for other items that we want to insert to complete our composition. Let's select a side base cabinet, depth 50 cm, and add it to the floor plan. We can use the 3D window to make sure we've positioned everything correctly. Let's go back to our floor plan, choose one of the side base cabinets available, and add it to our composition. In our 3D view, we can modify its elevation using the specific field on the right. At this point, we can change the finish of the furnishings placed. Let's select the body finish color, and here we find all the materials available, indicated by the manufacturer. We can decide whether to apply it just to a single item or to all the items we've inserted. Our next step will be adding some further items. On the right column, we can look for one of the undermount sinks from among those available. Or a vanity top, as in the case here. We can modify the vanity top finishing, choosing among the available ones. Let's now select the sink. To change the finish of the other furnishings placed, we'll do just like before and select Body Finish Color to find all available materials. Let's now customize the cabinet pulls by clicking on the appropriate menu on the right. We find various sizes and can again decide whether to apply this pull to one or all items. Last, let's choose the side base cabinets finishing from body finish color always. We've now completed our composition. It is possible to create a summary printout of all the items inserted into the project by clicking the button in the top left, which will generate a list of each item in its respective finish. Let's save our composition by clicking on Save on the top left of our header toolbar. As we move back to the layout window, we'll find the composition that Domus 3D has placed in the project. This composition is inserted as a single block, which can be moved around our room as desired. Let's take a look at the composition in the virtual navigation window as well. At this point, we'll move back to the layout window where we can complete our design project by inserting standard furnishings as well. For example, we can insert a meter and a faucet. If we want to modify the composition that we created, all we have to do is return to the modular furniture window and Domus 3D will automatically update the composition. 
Once we've completed the project, we can launch our rendering and generate a photorealistic image.